Welcome to Brain Booster. Have you ever wondered just how vast the universe truly is? Let's start at the beginning. Space, the final frontier, the great expanse, the celestial sea. It's a term that we often use, but what does it really mean? In the simplest terms, space is everything that exists beyond the limits of our planet. It's the stars, the galaxies, the nebulae, the black holes, and so much more. Now, when we talk about the size of space, we're not just talking about a few miles or kilometers. We're talking about distances so great that they're almost impossible for the human mind to comprehend. To make sense of it all, astronomers use special units of measurement like light years and parsecs. A light year, for instance, is the distance light travels in a single year, nearly six trillion miles. But how big is the universe? Well, that's a bit of a tricky question. You see, the universe is constantly expanding. It's getting bigger and bigger every single moment. But for now, let's focus on what we can observe. The observable universe, the part of the universe we can, in theory, see, is estimated to be about 93 billion light years in diameter. That's a mind-bogglingly huge number. To put it in perspective, if you were to travel at the speed of light, it would take you 93 billion years to cross from one end to the other. And within that immense expanse, it's filled with roughly two trillion galaxies, each brimming with billions of stars. Yet, what's perhaps even more remarkable is what this observable universe encompasses. It contains all of the galaxies, stars, planets, and other celestial bodies that we know of. It includes everything that has ever been observed or that could potentially be observed from Earth. But remember, these are just the parts of the universe we can see. Beyond that, there are mysteries untold. Our journey begins at home, on our very own planet Earth. A sphere of life, color, and diversity, spanning approximately 7,917 miles in diameter. It's a world that feels vast to us, its inhabitants. But let's take a step back and see how we measure up in the grand parade of planets. Next in line, we find our neighbor, Mars. Despite its reputation as the big red planet, Mars is only about half the diameter of Earth. It's like comparing a basketball to a beach ball. Then, we have the gas giants. Let's take Jupiter, the largest planet in our solar system. It's so big that it could swallow Earth whole and still have room to spare. If Earth were the size of a grape, then Jupiter would be the size of a basketball. In fact, over 1,000 Earths could fit inside this behemoth of a planet. But let's not forget the ringed beauty, Saturn. Though not quite as big as Jupiter, it's still a giant in its own right. Over 700 Earths could fit within its boundaries. Then we come to the outer fringes of our solar system, where we find Neptune and Uranus. These ice giants are still four times the size of Earth. Imagine our planet as a small car. Then Neptune and Uranus would be akin to a large lorry or a city bus. As we traverse the parade of planets, we are humbled by the immense scale of our solar system. Each planet, from the smallest rock to the largest gas giant, is a testament to the enormity of the cosmos. We are but a speck in this grand celestial dance, a tiny blue dot in a sea of stars and planets. Now imagine, if just one solar system holds such enormity, what might the rest of the universe contain? From planets, we move to galaxies, colossal collections of stars, gas, dust, and dark matter. These celestial cityscapes stretch across the vast expanse of the universe, leaving us in awe of their sheer size and magnificence. Our very own galaxy, the Milky Way, is a sprawling cosmic metropolis. It spans about 100,000 light years across, and it's home to a dizzying array of around 200 billion stars. If we were to travel at the speed of light, it would take us 100,000 years to cross from one side to the other, just imagine that. Yet, as grand as the Milky Way might seem, it's not the biggest kid on the galactic block. That honor goes to the Andromeda Galaxy, the largest galaxy in our local group. Andromeda dwarfs the Milky Way, stretching an impressive 220,000 light years in diameter. It's like a cosmic titan, boasting an estimated one trillion stars, a number that's simply too vast for our minds to fully comprehend. But even Andromeda is not the limit. As we gaze farther into the depths of the cosmos, we encounter galaxies of all shapes and sizes. Some are dwarf galaxies, 
humble and small, while others are supergiant galaxies, their grandeur unrivaled. There's a staggering variety out there, each one a unique testament to the diversity of the cosmos. And how many galaxies are there in the observable universe? Brace yourselves, for the numbers are truly mind-boggling. Current estimates suggest that there could be around 2 trillion galaxies within our cosmic horizon. That's 2 trillion distinct islands of stars, gas, and dust, each with their own unique tale to tell. Each galaxy a universe in its own right, and yet they are but tiny specks in the grand cosmos. So the next time you gaze up at the night sky, remember that each point of light might very well be an entire galaxy, a cosmic giant silently spinning its tail in the grand tapestry of the universe. In the grand scale of the universe, even galaxies are not the final frontier. Let's now move beyond the galactic giants and into the realms of the cosmos that are often overlooked. These are the regions where stars and galaxies are sparse, and light itself seems to hesitate the cosmic void. Imagine for a moment a space so vast and empty that even light, which travels at a mind-boggling speed of over 186,000 miles per second, takes millions of years to cross. This is the reality of the cosmic void. These voids are not small pockets of emptiness, they are colossal expanses, stretching across hundreds of millions of light years. To put that into perspective, if you were to travel at the speed of light, it would take you just over one second to circle the Earth seven and a half times. Now, imagine having to maintain that speed for hundreds of millions of years, just to cross one of these voids. Yet, these voids are not completely empty. They are speckled with faint galaxies, rogue stars, and elusive particles. These cosmic wanderers are so far apart that they hardly ever interact leading to an eerie silence that engulfs the void. The cosmic voids play a crucial role in shaping the universe as we know it. They are the yin to the galaxy's yang, contributing to the balance and structure of the cosmos. Their vastness and emptiness push galaxies and stars into clusters and superclusters, creating the intricate cosmic web that we observe today. In the grand scheme of things, these voids make up a staggering 95% of the universe. That's right, the stars, galaxies, and all the celestial bodies we marvel at make up a mere 5% of the cosmos. In the face of such vast emptiness, even galaxies seem insignificant. The cosmic voids truly embody the unfathomable scale and majesty of our universe. Yet, for all we've explored, we've barely scratched the surface of the cosmos. As humans, we've managed to probe into the vastness of the universe, stretching our understanding beyond the boundaries of our own galaxy. We've peered into the farthest reaches of the observable universe, 13.8 billion light years away. Yet what lies beyond this horizon of perception remains a mystery, a question that taunts our curiosity. The concept of the universe's size beyond our observable limits is a topic of intense debate among scientists. Some theories propose that the universe is finite, its edges perhaps curled up like a four-dimensional donut. Others suggest it may be flat and infinite, extending forever in all directions. Yet, there's another possibility that has captured the fascination of scientists and dreamers alike, the concept of the multiverse. This theory suggests that our universe may be just one of an infinite number of universes, each with its own laws of physics, its own history, its own reality. Imagine countless bubbles in a cosmic ocean, each a universe in its own right. This notion of the multiverse might seem like the stuff of science fiction, but it is a serious hypothesis entertained by some of the sharpest minds in cosmology. It's a concept that pushes the boundaries of our understanding, challenging our notions of existence and reality. Yet whether our universe is finite or infinite, whether we are alone or part of a multiverse, these questions remain unsolved. The answers lie in the uncharted territories of the cosmos, waiting for us to unravel their secrets. But one thing is certain. The universe, in its grandeur and complexity, is far larger than we can comprehend. Its scale transcends our human capacity to understand, leaving us in awe of its ungraspable enormity. So, when you gaze up at the night sky, remember, you're not just looking at stars. You're peering into the infinite. 
Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe.